I will keep going tonight. Hi guys, what's up? Welcome to or back to my channel. What's up guys? I feel like I haven't vlogged in a while, so I thought it would be fun to vlog this week, this weekend, whatever I get up to. Right now I'm with my baby boy G-Man over here. This is Grover. We're about to go on a hike. You ready, baby? You ready to go? Let's go. Over. We've been hiking. What is it? What is it? It is honestly such a gorgeous day and there's nobody on the trail right now, which is great because it's just like it's very freeing to be alone out in nature. Um, well, not alone. I'm with G Wilkers over here. But I just wanted to say hey and we're probably going to go back now. It's been about two miles maybe. Gigi, stop eating the flies. Stop. Oh my god. Um, but I just, I just love this so much. I need to do this more often. I definitely don't get out here enough. Um, I might just have to make it part of my routine, like every Thursday morning or something. But I just, I'm just stoked. I'm just feeling so good. And like being out here really, really clears my mind. And that's the update for now. As you guys can tell, this is a different camera. I got a new phone. This is the iPhone 11 Pro Max. The quality is spectacular for an iPhone. And so I feel like I'll be able to vlog a lot more because when I forget my camera and whatnot, like I'll just film on my phone. Watching this, go drink a glass of water. Wait a minute. What? What's that? Hey, there's Messi. What is that? Earplugs. Earplugs. You know why we need earplugs? Because we're going to a music festival today. No. I don't have any earplugs, but it's super important, yeah. What are we doing before we go to the music festival? We're gonna make this turn because the light is green. <laughs> no, we're gonna we're going go to surf Manhattan Beach. We're gonna get ready and then go. And we're also getting breakfast burritos right now. Yes we are. So I'll let you know how they taste. <laughs> it's a beautiful day in that lay, baby. Mm -hmm. Alright, we'll check in later, peace. I don't know about you, but I might take myself as a breakfast burrito connoisseur. <laughs> and let me tell you. Fire. This burrito is fire. Absolute fire. Coral tree. Straight diesel. Like gas. gasoline. Lee delicious. What do you think? I think it's Lee delicious. <laughs> what? Delicious. Why are you eating mine? Uh, no. <laughs> Where's mine? It's in the back. Let's just split both of them. Kind of a dumb. Hey, wait, let me have this one. Ready, Freddy? We're down here at El Porto, mate. Yeah. Yeah, about to get some surf. About to get some surf. Yeah, it took a long time to get a parking spot, but we got it, yeah. I reckon it took about 20 minutes. Yeah, look at this shit, so crowded. <laughs> look how many people trying to get a parking spot. It's just hectic down here, yeah? It's mad hectic. so hectic. Honestly, it's so hectic, I don't even know what to do. Ah. We're ready for surf. We both got our weddies on, yeah? Feeling crusty. Feeling <laughs> crusty. Oh my God. What? I just saw another man's penis. <laughs> <laughs> That's alarming. It's um, anyways, I just wanted to let everyone know we're about to go for a surf, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye now. Yeah. Try to tilt it more, tilt it more. Uh, Oops, missed. Ow, ow. It's chill. It feels so weird. Guys, we just surfed. It was pretty fun. <laughs> 
Did you have fun, Lily? I had a lot of fun. It was really fun. Yeah. Uh, I can't hear anything. We just put ear solution in because this surf break is right next polluted. to yeah it's some right runoff. Next to, like a what is that called? It's like a water treatment plant. So it's kind of nasty. Yep. Worth it. Worth it. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Can't it. Ah. Oh, it feels so relieving. Another one. It tickles so much. Anyways, what are you guys up to? <laughs> I wish they could reply. <laughs> Comment down below. What are you up to? <laughs> Comments are just gonna be like, uh, I'm just chilling, like watching YouTube, obviously. Ugh. Ew, that feels so gross in my ears. But they feel clean now. I'm so excited Duh, for the rest of the day. I literally want to surf like 10 hours a day. Me too. We went to the Skeggs concert. When do we go to the Skeggs concert? Thursday night. On Thursday. Insert clips here. Anyways, I'm gonna look super bad at this festival because we're gonna go to Lily's to get ready, but Lily's is just as far as the festival is from here. So I'm just gonna go, no makeup, no nothing, just cruising for bruising. And it's gonna be all right. Cause we're gonna get gross and dirty anyway. So it's like, who really cares? I kind of care. Sending it. Sending it, yeah, yeah, yeah. boys. We're just walking up to the festival. I just took a very long pee. You know, I'm just super hydrated like that. Drinks too much water. Don't drink a glass of water every day, everybody. What? Gatorade. That's disgusting. Why would you say that? No makeup for the boys. Looking swagged. <laughs> I literally look like I just woke up. <laughs> what? See you in there. to know through and through every aspect of it. Cool. Hey 
guys, I promise I'm still here. Good morning, everybody. We're going down to the beach. Okay. Oh my god. It scared me. Why do you run by so fast? We're down at the beach, playing some volleyball. Well, for the first time in like a hundred years. Look how red my arms are. <laughs> Kinda hurts your arms, yeah? Uh, just cruising for a bruising. Peace and love. Day two of the festival. Hey guys, we're at a festival. Hey guys, we're at the festival. Yeah, guys, we're just showing up to the festival. Why are you talking like that? They did the same thing. Oh my god. Anyways, I did a really fun makeup. It was very spontaneous of me. All of a sudden, it was just on my face. And oh no. Oh no. I am going to tell them what you've done to me. He took his hand, put my hand on his butt, and then farted. Okay, anyways, enough of that. So we're going to put that festival. in the video. Come on. It's so cold. Go daughters. Look who we met up with! Hello! I got some dinner. I got the rice and orange chicken minus the rice and add the chicken. Anyways, where are we? Who are we going to be seeing next? We're waiting for Gold Link. We're at the NOS stage. No, we're at the Flog stage. All the stages are like sound the same. And it's gonna be Frank tonight. I think it's gonna be Asa. So guys, if you didn't know, there is like a mysterious artist that's gonna be playing and headlining tonight. And everyone's thinking I thought it's gonna be like Frank. announced it on like Friday to get the ticket sales up. And I'm honestly so impressed that they're waiting till literally he comes on stage. Yeah, it's gonna be exciting. So stay tuned to see who it is. You know, they, they told me to come out and like do maybe two or three songs for y'all tonight, but I'ma ask your permission, because I know this is your festival. I'ma ask your permission if I can stay up here and turn up and keep Like I said, I'm here for you tonight. If you want to keep going, I will keep going tonight. What's up? If you want to keep going, I will keep going tonight. Well, look, it's been love. I love y'all. I go by the name of Drake. Thank you for having me. It's good. Hemp, yeah. Cranberry. Do you have any like fun toppings? Which one's cooler, right or left? Literally the same. Comment down below. Oh, blueberries. So Conan is this like music guy, right? We just made the most fire song. Should we play it for them? All I know is that 
we just spent three hours of our life doing this. So if you don't, <laughs> like, if you don't like it, like honestly, just unsubscribe. <laughs> that was a joke. Please don't unsubscribe. Uh, I'll see you in the car. Get the fuck off of my set. I might just punch your head. I might just shoot your chest. I might just shoot your face. I might just shoot this place. I might just shoot up the place. So nobody is standing. Yeah. I'm in the Staples parking lot because I've realized that I'm like very much a visual person when it comes to like planning out my life, planning out my day to day life, um, my work life, everything. And so I really need a calendar that I can just write out everything that I need to do, color coordinate it, make lists, just like get myself more organized because if I don't do that my filming schedules all over the place my editing my freaking meetings everything it just gets like so overwhelming if I do it on any other type of calendar whether that be like a digital calendar or um in reminders or tasks or whatever like I really truly need either someone telling me exactly what I need to do or to structure my life in a very simple easy to read kind of way I think I've just really realized that about myself recently and so I need a physical calendar that I can personally write out everything that I need to do in my own handwriting, in my own everything. Anyways, enough about that. I'm just gonna go into Staples, grab that, and then head home and start writing it out. It's so cool. Let's go to Staples, ha. like a real calendar and like not a planner there's a freaking cutout of Shaq over there and I thought it was a real person Here's the calendar that I got. Um, this whole little giddy up situation here was $28. So it's not cheap to be organized, people. It is not cheap to be organized. But for me, it's really important to have like a full month calendar. I can't really do the planners with the weeks or the days. Like that just, I need to see things with the big kind of picture. That's just kind of how my brain works. Uh, go ahead, you wanna go outside? Wanna go outside? This one starts in July, obviously it's November. So that's kind of a waste, but here's November. I also got some new pens and highlighters. So I'm gonna start writing out my week, my month. Do you guys like my Igor sweatshirt? I got this last night at Camp Flognaut, freaking cute. It was definitely like the most abstract color and weirdest kind of one. And I thought it was cool because I have a lot of basic hoodies. Speaking of last night, I don't know how I haven't talked about the fact that Drake was literally booed off stage last night and it was devastating, Grover. And I was very upset about it because I am a huge Drake fan and everyone was mad about it. Like Conan and I and Lily were the only three people in the entire freaking crowd around us that were like jamming and singing and so freaking happy to see Drake up on the stage. Everyone thought it was gonna be Frank, Frank Ocean that is. And so everyone was really like disappointed that it was Drake. And I just like don't understand how people could be disappointed that it was Drake. Like how, like I understand like you really wanted to see Frank, but like it's freaking Drake. Like. How can you not be like so ecstatic and like stoked and like grateful that you get to literally see Drake? I was like blown away that Drake was freaking on the stage and like no one around us cared, but that didn't stop Conan and I from literally jamming the frick out. It was amazing until 
Drake so humbly was booed off the stage because people thought that it was gonna be Frank and it was very sad, but whatever. The show ended early. We went home. Well, actually we got in and out and then we went home. It was just a freaking weekend, if I do say so myself. And I didn't get my Monday things done today. And I think that's why all of a sudden I've been like motivated to go out, buy myself a calendar to really get everything on the page. Um, this is something I just need to do for my brain. I'll feel, I feel like I'll feel a lot more structured. By the way, it's dark and it's five and it makes me very upset this whole time change thing. Growing up in Maui, we didn't have um, daylight savings. So this is a very much still a shock to my system, even though I haven't lived home in a very long time. It's annoying. I feel like it's affecting me. Also, it's the full moon tonight. And I feel like that's affecting me as well. What is going on? I don't know. That's it. That's the tea. That's the tea for now, folks. <laughs> I saw me planning, journaling, doing that whole calendar thing. I had dinner and it was delicious. I had salmon with bok choy and rice and beans. I have been having a little bit of skin troubles. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you've seen that I've been posting a little bit about it, but I have been trying out different face masks, different skincare, everything. So I thought I would try this goop one. I recently tried this Timi detox mask. I really liked it. I'm gonna continue to try that out and I'll let you guys know what I think about it. But for now, I'm gonna try this Goop one. This is a clean beauty brand. This is supposed to be really good. I've been really liking their moisturizer as well as their night cream. So hopefully I will like this little guy. Anyways, this is probably gonna be pretty close to the end of the vlog. Um, if you guys liked this style of weekly vlog, let me know. Uh, definitely let me know what you think, if you like it. It's definitely a lot easier for me to film just cause it's whenever I remember throughout the week versus doing like a day. I don't know, like I don't always feel like vlogging a whole day or whatever it is, but I just feel like this is more fun vlog to watch. And these are definitely the vlogs that I prefer watching because I feel like you get like a lot more action versus like a day in the life. Anyways, that's on the skin for now, so. That mask made my skin so red, but I don't know, it's hard to tell from one use and 10 seconds later, but that's the update about that mask. My skin is like literally burning, so hopefully it didn't damage my skin. Ah! You guys, it is the morning after I used that exfoliating mask. That was last night and I'm honestly like really shocked. I'm not sure if it was the mask or just a good night of rest or the moisturizer or what, but my skin is feeling amazing. It's feeling amazing. That's all I can say. Amazing. Anyways, if you guys made it this far in the vlog, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Let me know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me know obviously what you guys thought of like this weekly kind of vibe situation. If you guys like it, if you guys hate it, let me know so I know. Um, I'm definitely gonna start vlogging like a lot more. If you guys like that, and uh, that's all for now. And of course, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Tringsby. I post lots of fun stories, fun stuff, fun, fun times. I love you all so dearly. And I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to go drink a glass of water. Peace, deuces. cheese with no fork i had a spoon i was eating it all by myself at noon